church. We got to see our friendship again. It's our next Bible class. Uh, somebody pray for us too. Pray for this class. Help us, Lord. Heavenly Father, we come this evening, dear God, to give you all the praise and give you all the honor and all the glory, dear God. We come, Heavenly Father, to learn of your word this evening, dear God. We ask that you open up our minds, dear God, that we may receive it, dear God, and not just receive it, dear God, but that we may take it, dear God, and, and, and walk the way you want us to walk and live the way you want us to live, dear God. That some man, woman, boy, or girl may come running and ask what must I do to be saved, dear God. We ask, dear God, that you bless our pastor today, dear God, bless our teacher this today, dear God, the town is here, the more yeah. wisdom, the more knowledge, dear God. We ask that you bless those that are here, bless those that are to come, and bless us, those that have a desire to be here tonight, but for whatever reason, to not be here, dear God. Let us be blessed this neighborhood, dear God. So take it away somebody tonight, dear God, and then they come and want to be a part of this body of Christ, dear God. And, and we ask, dear God, that you bless our sick and our shut dear God. And all these Lord. things we ask. And we pray in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. 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 We again, this is Pastor Franklin, and this is the Lodge of Southern Eastern Baptist Church. And we are here for the <coughs> Bible study night. This is, this is Wednesday, in case you don't know, it's 7 o'clock, and uh, close to that anyway. And remember last week, we were still continuing talking about. Paul's letter to the to the Corinthians, the 15th chapter, concerning the concerning the, the resurrection of Christ and and all of the controversy within uh, within the churches, first century churches, and, and Paul writes his letters, all the epistles is to address certain problems in the church that he that was right uh, right to Paul and get his solution to the problem or uh, uh, he's one of the apostolic leaders and so he writes concerning this problem that there were some that said in the church that they had, that, uh, that there is no resurrection or Christ is not lost and dead. Um, Paul, Paul tells him that, uh, in the Philippians the third chapter the tenth verse the resurrection of Christ our 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 whole the whole <clears throat> set up on the fact that Jesus got up out of the grave, the resurrection of Christ, the foundation of our gospel, that he he was he was he was buried, he he, he died that he was buried and he was raised from the dead. If you take away the, the resurrection and everything else falls apart, uh, it, it, it would suggest to us that that he, that he was not who he said that that he that he was. Paul said in, in Philippians that I might I might know him and the power of his resurrection. And so who is, is him that he needs to know? Uh, uh, Jesus is who he's God. Amen. Uh, God said in the beginning was the word, the word was with God, and the word was, the word was God. <coughs> God, the very God who, who uh, walked among us, he became flesh, God said, walked among us in specific reasons for him doing so, yeah. it's a specific reason for him mm -hmm. emptying himself mm -hmm. and becoming a servant and being obedient, becoming a man and giving up his life is for the specific purpose of, of dying for others. Mm -hmm. I said last week that, it, that it, it dying itself is not unique because people die, uh, but the fact that, that his death was unique is that he didn't die for himself, but he died, he died for others. Mm -hmm. It was a substitutionary death, but he came to die for, for us. Mm -hmm. uh, and the us, the us, you know, we evaluate the us, the us that had nothing going for itself, mm -hmm. right? And while, while we were yet sinners, mm -hmm. uh, that Christ came and gave his life for us. And this was mm -hmm. under the agreement of the God here that was decided that this is how uh, the plan of salvation would work, that the Son of God would come and die for for the elect mm -hmm. that that the Father would save would have saved in eternity. The Son comes to give His life, and without without the substitution of the propitiatory death of Christ, then everybody, all of us, is still in their in their sin, yes. uh, and you couldn't you couldn't get out of sin because every man that's born of Adam, the first Adam, come here as a sinner with the judgment of God upon his head. 
and there ain't nothing that he can do to, to, to remove it from him but die. Amen. The wages of sin is the punishment of God. The wages of sin is death. But who imposed the wages? God did. Mm -hmm. uh, and the fact that all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God, that there was no way out of it except to, to pay the penalty. And so that that would that would say that all men were headed to hell. Uh, without without the interference of God, without the grace of God, all of us would be going. But God. But God. Right? He, he, the, 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 the solution to a man's dilemma of a holy God and him being able to to, to, to meet the requirements of this holy God is that God sent his son yes. uh, and, and poured out his wrath upon his son and gave us the righteousness of his son. Help us, Jesus. And so we will we'll, we'll meet his standard because we bear the righteousness of his son. Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, and Christ bore our sin. Yes. And so the wrath of God was performed upon the Son of God by by submission and instruction. Mm -hmm. uh, and though he was God, the Bible said he was found in the form of God, thought it not robbery <laughs> to be equal with God, but made of himself of no reputation, be found in the form of a servant. Uh, mm -hmm. That's the servant attitude. He was obedient. Mm -hmm. uh, being found in the fashion of a man, he, 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 he became obedient unto death. And the, the, the most horrific death that of, the, of his time was the death of the cross. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. And remember, I said it's not, it's not, to be, it's not that, that the dying thing was is, is that he died for others. Uh, and and, and the, the, the proof that he died for others is that he died up. Yeah. Help us, Jesus. He died up. Mm -hmm. who, who is this Jesus? Mm -hmm. right, that I may know him. Well, the book of Colossians talks about him. It says, it says, in the first, it says that all things were made mm -hmm. by him. Mm -hmm. uh, he was before all things, and that whether the things uh, are spiritual or, or, or physical, that he made it. Uh, he, he even made his enemies. And I did the bunch of, he even made the devil. There's not nothing that he did not make. Uh, help us, Lord, and, and, and remember, he, he is he is the preeminent one that has that has the power over all things, whether the power is the millions or whatever it may be. He rules. Yes, he does. Uh, the, the 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 God the Jesus that we know, who was resurrected, uh, he ruled. He was raised, and because because he was obedient unto death. God elevated him up, gave him a name. Mm -hmm. Help us, Jesus. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now, now listen, I said we, we, we concluded that he is God, and he can't be no more God than what he is, right? That's right. <laughs> but God gave him, God gave him something else. God gave him an elevated position. He placed him on his on his right hand mm -hmm. and put all things, and you'll see it here. He gave him preeminence and power over everything. He's not just he's not just the Lord over the church, and of course he is, right? He, he, he's yeah. our Lord. But but listen, when he got up, God made him Lord over everything. Mm -hmm. Help us over the whole creation. Yeah. Help us, Lord. Remember, yeah. hey, that that that's what he was done to Adam. He said, "You will have dominion." Right? If everything creeping under the sea, on top of the wall, everything moving about, you got the dominion, Adam, and bring your wife with you too, and y'all get together, and y'all are going to have multiplied in yourselves and so forth, and y'all are going to have dominion over the whole place, but he messed up. Yes. Right? And so, and so, and so he lost his rulership. Help us, Lord. And so God did another, God sent the second Adam. Help us, Lord. Mm -hmm. And because he was obedient unto death, God gave him a name that's above every name, that the name of, of Jesus, every knee have to bow and tongue confess that Jesus is who? Lord. The Lord. Mm -hmm. the Lord. And so we pre we limit our preaching sometimes and limit our our witnesses sometimes because we limit him just to the ghetto, just to the church. Huh? Well, but he way because he got up, he's way bigger than that. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, yeah. He's Lord of the whole universe. Oh, yeah. God made him Lord of the whole of the whole universe. That, that's what he is. So we preach God said he's Lord that he's Lord of the church all right. Mm-hmm. Uh, because we bow to him, right? Amen. But every knee help us, Lord, and go have to bow to him. And he's still and he's the preeminent one. Once he got up, he got rulership and authority. Mm-hmm. Uh, so he rules this world. Mm-hmm. Uh, and so and so Paul talks about in in in, in First Corinthians the fifteen, they they all about you know, I told you last week, he said they were able to deliver the, the gospel and as long as they, they held on to it, right, they were, they were in good standing, it would be okay. Huh? Because remember, we say that salvation, God saved us, he is saving us, and he shall save us. Amen. Huh? He, 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 he saved us from the, 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 uh, the power, of, the penalty of sin, the power of sin, mm-hmm. and then eventually the very presence of sin. Mm-hmm. And, and he ruled. The Lord is a sin, is sin and our being is a death I mean, we big problem, huh? In, in terms of having dominion over us because it's not it's not possible because we are free of. Right? Mm-hmm. And so that's the gospel. That's the gospel. That's that Christ came, he died, he was buried, he was raised from the dead. This is what Paul said, you hold on to that, then, then you're gonna be you're gonna be saved. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. No, you hold, you hold on to y'all keep, y'all keep that. And so, and so then he starts talking about those people that who witness the resurrection. Because remember, that's the problem that he's dealing with, is the resurrection. Some say that, uh, some were, actually, some were saying that, that, that the resurrection already taken place. Uh, they were saying it already taken place. And he had to deal with that. Now, you know, if the resurrection had taken place, we then have a problem. Uh, because in, in the resurrection, the dead of Christ had to get up. Amen. Uh, all the day, not some of them. Huh? And then, when, then, if, 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 he, if he did that, then, then he, had to, he had to assume his position in his totality as Lord. So that had not taken place yet. So it was saying some things that need to be corrected. And so, and so, and so Paul first always said, if the dead, if, the, if, if Christ is not, if he's not raised from the dead, then the dead didn't rise. Mm-hmm. Uh, they didn't rise. And, so, and then he started getting the negative that we didn't rise, we, we, but we didn't raise for the dead, then your faith is in vain. You know, we, 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 we say goodbye to all your people and stuff. I see you. <laughs> <laughs> see you, man. I'm out there. And then we, we wasted that. Mm-hmm. He said, if that's the case, your, 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 your faith is in vain. Mm-hmm. Uh, you, need to, you need to enjoy yourself. Huh? We are in constraint because we are looking to go to heaven, huh? yeah. and, we, and we are we are saved that we are we are we are, we are, we are, we are heavenly influenced by our ca- ca- character and characteristics, the things that we do. Huh? Yeah. We are we want to live holy lives, yes. you, you know. We, we expect, but he said, if, if, if he didn't rise, then you're wasting your time. <laughs> yeah. huh? You need you need to you need to. Stop coming your Bible study, you study your Sunday school and your church service and stop bothering people and get you some clothes that, that you do what you didn't want to do. That you can fight your flesh fight to get your spirit to try to break free and you've been holding to get going about your business, girl. <laughs> do your thing. Um, and so he talked about that's the name that he said, he said, if, if Christ be not raised, and that was his first argument, he said, all that stuff. Is it is it is it vain? Mm-hmm. He said in verse five he said, then he's talking about talking about the witnesses. He talked about seek was first. He said, and that he was seen so that if you got up from the grave, remember, somebody ought to see him. Uh-huh. And remember, he doesn't present himself to the world, but he presented himself to the church and to the people that are saved. Now I told you last week that they were not the secrets and the rest were not the first witnesses, the women were. Mm-hmm. Right? Remember? Mm-hmm. The women were, but Paul does not list them in his in his refute. He does not list them because women had no no uh, they, they weren't recognized by the courts. They could stand in the courts and, and give testimony because of what? Because they were women. Mm-hmm. So he didn't bother to put their names out. But they were the first witness. Remember, uh, Easter Sunday they came to the they came to the grave and the angel said to them, "I know you're looking for him, mm-hmm. but he's not here." Mm-hmm. 
he had risen like he said he would. Yeah. Uh, but, from, but he couldn't put, he couldn't miss them because the courts at that time would not accept the women's testimony. Mm -hmm. Help us, Jesus. Now you take the women out of this picture, you got a little sad church, oh, right? Yeah. Help us, Lord. He said, but he said, there was seen by Cephas. Okay, we know about Cephas. He, he said, the, he sent the women to tell the men, and then the guy said, tell Peter too. Have him come too. And so, and so he named Peter as one who saw him after the resurrection. And then he says, and after he was seen of about 500 brethren. Now he, he lists his brethren because, because time had passed. And listen, if you want proof that he, he was raised from, and he raised from the dead, you got some folks that are still living. Initially, he 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 was seen by five hundred, and, and and Paul says, and, and the greater Paul remained unto his presence, but some are falling asleep. Mm -hmm. uh, some are dying. How are we going to witness it? So Peter there, and he, and he appeared to five hundred brethren. He said, and some of the brethren are still living. The majority of them are still living. Uh, Paul, Paul mindset. Paul mindset. Remember. Was that was that he had the mindset that that yeah Christ died was buried was raised was raised up in heaven but he was coming back mm -hmm. and his idea of coming back was soon yeah. mm -hmm. uh, was soon Paul did not expect to be in the grave when Christ came back mm -hmm. just while when we get to First Thessalonians he starts talking about the trumpet God shall 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 sound and let me say and we who are alive. Mm -hmm. uh, that, would that have been good news? <laughs> that bad news was, but that good news is. Oh, yeah. So he, he, he was expected to be alive. Mm -hmm. and, and, the, and, the, and, the, and the whole lot of them expecting that. So they begin to sell their stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, and mm -hmm. they start, start, start living off of you know, each other and this kind of thing. Mm -hmm. they, because they, they were looking for them to come right back and sort of give up all their worldly stuff. And, uh, and then we had the idle people that wasn't doing like going around. And so there's a whole mess that he had to deal with in First Thessalonians. So he says, so so he says, he said that there are five hundred and some are seen. And then he says in verse verse seven, after that he was seen of James, mm -hmm. and then of the apostles. He was there. James is the brother, one of his, one of his brothers by way of of, of Joseph. Mm -hmm. Who didn't believe in that he was who he said he was? No, mm -hmm. your, your folks are the last one to believe you, right? Amen. They're the last one to believe. They've been with you too long. They know you. You saw something happened to me. I was born again, and they laugh at you. And the first thing they say is that you're crazy, right? Mm -hmm. oh, you should see so and so. He done went crazy. Mm -hmm. uh, they didn't think you were crazy when you were spending all your money and running all out with the women and doing all that other stuff. They thought you were insane. Uh, oh, yeah. And you have to keep in mind, help us, Lord. On your way to hell, yeah, too. But, but the minute Christ saved you, is a different story. Oh, uh, yeah. In other words, there's a contrast between you then and you now. Mm -hmm. uh, or you, you just con it ought to be a contrast. There ought, ought to be something different that, that took place in your life that when folks see you, they're shaking their head because they say, I can remember when. Help us, Lord. If you don't have folks there remember when in, in that come in contact with you, then baby, something's wrong. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> child, that thing needs to be something else. Stay, you stay in the ballroom. Stay in mm -hmm. there. Get her name all on the, on the bathroom the door and stuff. <laughs> Help us, Lord. They say, he was seen of the and then of all the all the apostles, uh, of all the apostles. Not just talking about the twelve apostles, but all the apostles. The apostles of those who who, who, was, who followed him, uh, and they, they there was more that but the inner circle was, 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 was the twelve minus Judas, and with the, with the addition of, of the last of, of God, they, they shot dice with and came up with it. Now I can't think of his name, right? Yeah, Matthias. So he was a. He said last of all was seen of me. Mm -hmm. So folks, so, so 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 Paul now says the last apostle. The original apostle was him who was seen, who was seen, the last seen of me also as one born <coughs> out of due time. Uh, remember the original apostle was, was the one that Christ sent out. Uh, you had two kinds. You had some that the church sent out, and you had another, you had the original with the 12 uh, that, that, that Jesus himself sent out. 
And so Paul was the last guy that he sent out. Remember, remember who said Paul was going to send you before kings and princes mm -hmm. and all this kind of stuff, and you shall give testimony. Well, that made that made Paul an apostle uh, with the original, just like the original, because they they was under they was under the the, the tutelage of Paul of Christ for three years, and Paul was under the same training by Christ for three years before he sends him out. Uh, and so there was the original. So you can't, you can't, you, you can't, you, you can't replace the original. You know, those are the one. But the church sins of apostles just mean one who is sent, right? Mm -hmm. One who is sent. And and Paul said, I was the least of of the, of the twelve, the least of the guys, because I persecuted the church. Mm -hmm. I, I did. I caused folks harm and tried to destroy the church. Only when he came into contact with Christ, it was at a different end in his life. For I am the least of the apostles that are not need to be called apostles because I persecuted the church of God. But by the grace of God, I am what I am, and his grace, which was bestowed upon me, was not in vain, but I labored more abundantly than they all, yet not I, but the grace of God, which was, which was with me. Um, if there was something in me that made me mm -hmm. do more than any of the rest of them. Uh, and a lot of times you get that from folks who are heavy in sin, they, they, have a, they have a desire to just to do, you know, and not, 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 not so much to earn their salvation, but, but, but to give their whole life to God. You know, most of us don't see ourselves as that big of a sinner, so we don't come in like that. But there are folks who are, who are, who are heavy sinners, right? and when they gave themselves to the Lord, they gave themselves totally and absolutely. There was nothing that came before the Lord, but nothing in the world came before him. And so they gave their entire life and the energy and the purpose and just to glorify God. Mm -hmm. uh, and they worked more than all the rest of the folks. Help us, Jesus. It says, therefore, whether it were I or they, so we preach and so you believe. All of us. All of us. So, so now if Christ be preached that he rose from the dead, how say some among you that there is no resurrection? But there is, but if there is nothing to deal with the negative, there is no resurrection. I told you, he mm -hmm. said, from the dead, then Christ is not risen. Mm -hmm. And then if he's not risen, then he goes on to say, you're preaching in vain, mm -hmm. your faith in vain, mm -hmm. and you found false witnesses, and so forth. If Christ did not raise your faith, then you're, you're still in your sin. And then, uh, if, if, if this, and he concluded, if this life only we have hope in Christ, we are all men most miserable. But now, if we're not given the poverty of Mm -hmm. Verse 20, but now Christ is risen from the dead and become the first fruit of them that slept. And mm -hmm. we deal with the first fruit. Whatever you get the first fruit, that's the day to God. Mm -hmm. And that's that's guaranteed that all the rest is on the way. Mm -hmm. When you came to God as a, as a, a, a Jew and with that cultural situation, you brought your first fruit to God. Uh, and, and, and the rest of it stood in the ground, but you trusted God that it was on the way. And that that it would be just just as good as this one, uh, and so he's our first group, mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. and the guarantee the guarantee is that that we're coming behind him. We got a guarantee of something. Yes. We oh, have yes. we have the seal of the Holy Spirit. Yes. We have His Word. We have the seal of the Spirit that as He rules, we're going to do the same. We're going to do the same thing. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, we 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 died with Him, did we? Oh yeah, we died in Christ. We died in Him. We died in Him. We, we died in Him. He, he took us as, as Adam took us all down in sin. By one man, sin came into the world. From sin came death, and all men sinned. All men died. And He's going to go do that contrast here. So, so the same is with Christ. By one man, huh? He took us with Him to the cross, and He's the head of our our, our part of the federation. And when we went, when he went to the cross, he took us. And when he got up, we got up. And when he watched this here, because there's no more separation. And listen, when he ascended and sat on the right hand of God, guess who else went with him? Yeah, yes, man. Uh -huh. Yeah, that, that ought to make you feel good. Yeah, uh, yeah. Because you can't separate us, huh? Yeah. Uh, is in, we are inseparable. When he when he died up and sat on the right hand of God, he took the church, he took us with him. Yes, 
It, 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 he brought he brought man flesh where it where it never had gone before, and he could never go without him. Mm -hmm. uh, he stands in heaven as, as, a, as, a, as a person, help us, Lord. Uh, he, he, he's not just a representative; he became a man. Yes, help us, Lord Jesus. Oh, yes, yes, sir. Yeah, and so he rose, and so the Bible speaks of that that we are, we are seated in heaven. In heaven. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. We are seated in heavenly, heavenly places. Uh, remember, this salvation, this salvation is, is, is has to be completed. Uh, and the completion of the salvation is that this corrupt body put on incorruption, and this mortal put on immortality. Uh, there's a, there's going to be a finished product to this to this thing here. Because remember, He called us. Those whom He called. He, he justified. Mm -hmm. And watch this. Those of whom he justified, he what? He glorified. We got glorification coming. Mm -hmm. no, but this, ain't, this ain't the end of nothing here. We, we go so far. This ain't the end. We got glorification coming. It's all, it, it, it because, it because, because he said, as the sovereign God and as the Lord, there ain't nothing that's able to prevent it from happening. We're going to be exactly what he. Oh, help us, Lord. Oh, We're going to be made in, his, in, his, in the image of God. Mm -hmm. Watch this, watch this. Well, what, is, what is the image of God? Well, the book the book Galactic gives you what the image of God is like. Huh? Mm -hmm. It's in parts of Jesus. Yes. <laughs> yeah. we, it says, We're going to be made in the image of God. Well, what the image of God is? Well, mm -hmm. it, 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 the Colossians parts of Jesus say he is the express image. Mm -hmm. You want to know what the image of God looks like? You got to point to Jesus. Yeah. Uh, you know the man made in the image of God? You got to point to Jesus. <laughs> uh, and so, and so, so we're going to be made just like him. He's transforming us into the image. Okay. Help us, Lord. Oh, Help us, Lord. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And so, so you can't, that can't happen except there is a resurrection. Mm -hmm. uh, because the resurrection verifies the fact that he is who he said that he is. Oh, yeah. uh, we, read, we read the Bible. And all of his miracles, and, and he gives you, you read John, he gives you miracle after miracle after miracle, and it concludes that wait a minute, only God is able to do what he did. Mm -hmm. uh, only God is able to, 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 to create stuff out of nothing, take two fishes and make, and make bread. And only God is able to do that. Only God is able to command that wind and water, those kind of things. That only the Creator has power over can speak to those things, and those things, listen, those things have to obey Him. It, 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 it don't just wait to do it; it stops. Help us, Jesus, and all the all, all the demons and devils huh, will respond the way they get. And we know who you are. Help us, Jesus. You're the Holy One of God. Uh, we, we know who you. We know who you are. They had more sense than man. A man was still scratching his head wondering, who is this? Mm -hmm. Help us, Jesus. And the demons know exactly, and I tell you who else know who he is now. Mm -hmm. Every soul that has gone to hell know who Jesus is. Oh, yeah. Help us, Lord. There ain't no doubt about it. Uh, everybody in hell right now know who Jesus is. Mm -hmm. uh, help, help us, Lord. Mm -hmm. except, except because he's, he's, he's Lord. Right? Yes, he, he, he don't just rule this world. But he rule all worlds. Yeah. Help us, Lord. He, he rule all worlds. Go down, go down in, 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 in the process of rising, go down to hell mm -hmm. uh, and, and, and take captivity captive. Uh, mm -hmm. Those of whom have been waiting on him, who have who have been placed into that position, in that place, waiting on the Messiah to show up between the time he died and the time he rose, he goes down, Peter says. In the hell where we where, where we would have been going, oh, yeah. he had to go wherever we had to go. Yeah. Help us, he didn't stay there. Uh, mm -hmm. He goes there and he brings up his people. Yes. Help us, the place for the righteous and the place for the dead. You know, remember that's how the situation was. He goes down there to get up to get his people out. Everybody was waiting on him. Job mm -hmm. said, I, "I know my redeemer living." Uh, and I'm, I'm going to see him with these eyes. And I know Job was looking. Uh, mm -hmm. And some of the other old patriarchs was looking. 
waited on Jesus to show up. They had faith on his coming. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. Huh? Mm -hmm. and, and listen, they were looking, they were looking forward to it mm -hmm. by faith. And the church is looking back mm -hmm. at it by faith. Mm -hmm. You know, it's all by faith. Well, where do you get these things from, preacher? Well, God gave them faith. Yeah. Uh, and you got faith, you got faith, it's not because you came here with it, it's because God gave you, oh, gave yes. you faith mm -hmm. to believe what you believe. Mm -hmm. I had to fix your head. Yes, had to get your mind right. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. You were still trying to how to figure out uh, how to, how it was done, you know. Mm -hmm. and, and, and now you know, we, we understand we understand how the thing went, but but exactly to really explain it, you, you couldn't do it. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. You, you had to ask the question, why would God save me? Mm -hmm. Why did he save you? Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> You know, what, 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 why are you doing? You know, you 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 stop. You you caught right there. We're trying to figure that that, that kind of stuff out. You you can't figure him out because if if, if thoughts are not our thoughts and his ways are not our ways, huh? Where where you would go right, God somewhere on the left somewhere. Huh? When you're looking for one place, God show up another place. Huh? When you you say I would have done it, I would have done it this way. Help us, Jesus. And listen, and if you'd have done it that way, you just say, you know, it wouldn't work that way. Uh, one, one of the things that, that God, when God takes us through trials, is that, is that when the trial is finally concluded, we are, we are end up saying it could not have worked no other way than how God made it work. Oh, yeah. Help us, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. We, we said that, that was the only way it could have worked. Some, some of those trials, man, I had to lose something. I had to lose my mind. Mm -hmm. Help us, Jesus. I, I, that, that was the most, most uh, that painful situation. Mm -hmm. But then, then, you, then, you, then, then the time went on, and you saw how God worked that thing, and how oh, yeah. you, 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 had, you had cut that, that thing from strain, and if you, had, if you hadn't cut it, huh, you would still be blowing your mind. Yes, Lord. Still got your mama like. Your mama in water. In your mama's house, help us, Jesus. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> and every time somebody says, I'm going to my mama. Help us, Lord. Help us, Jesus. So, and so, <laughs> and so, and so God, God does it in a way that it looks terrible when it's happening. It looked insane when it when it's happening. Look, look, look how silly. We, we, we saw the death and and, and the hottest thing that just exploded and tragedy and all of that kind of stuff. Yeah, you know, I'm talking about the big storm that we had. Mm -hmm. And we we said, Lord Jesus, people dying and float mm -hmm. on the wall and this and that happened. And, and here we are, here we are 20 years later, mm -hmm. and we say, man, God did a wonderful thing. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. He, oh, yeah. he, he sent oh. folks out of this, this dreadful place at times uh -huh. and got them educated and educated yeah. their children oh, right? yes. and broke the stigma of, 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 of the, this thing that we have about <coughs> good time and all these things like the good time rule and mm -hmm. folks and folks the, the rearranged got rearranged their lives and, and, oh, and folks yes. and bought houses and Amen. got jobs and stuff. And then when they come back, say, I said, I'll never come back down there. The writer said that it was good that I was afflicted. Yeah. Yeah. It was good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Help us, Lord. He said, if in this life we have hope in Christ, we are all most miserable. But now is Christ risen from the dead and become the first fruit of them that slept. For since man came dead, by man came also the resurrection of the dead. For if, as in Adam all died, even so in Christ shall all be made, made alive. The contrast, right? So if Adam brought us dead with the second Adam. The second Adam. We, we bore this, this body that you're in. Is, is from the first Adam. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a natural body. Uh, it says, it didn't come to the end, then he shall, verse 21, that delivered up the kingdom 
to die, even the Father, when he shall have put off without all rules and all authority and power. For he must reign till he has put all enemies under his feet. The last enemy that shall be destroyed is death. Mm-hmm. That's the last enemy. Now listen, <laughs> so you understand. What he has done to death is that he has, he has taken the, the sting out of death. Mm-hmm. Right? And the sting of death is what? It's sin. The sting, what? The, the sting of death is sin. Mm-hmm. Now, but he's taken the sting out of death. Now, he took the sting himself. The beast could only sting you one time. He stung him. Okay. And so death, death can't, can't sting you. All death can do is bring you to God. Oh, yeah. All death can do is because you, you've been appointed to God. All death is able to do. can't sting you. Because there's no sin of all involved with death. Death, death. death, death has a sting for the sinner, and he can't get rid of it. But for us, Christ has taken the sting. Oh, oh, death. Where, where's the sting? Oh, oh, grave. Where, where's the victory? Uh, and just to, just to resurrect the Christ who's saying this, uh, because he got up. If he got up, then we got to get up. Uh, death, well, death has lost his sting because the thing that is sin, and he has bore our sin. Bore our sin. Oh, yeah. uh, and so, and so, and so, and so they, they may lay you down. And notice, notice the, when you're talking about Christians, it never says death. Mm-hmm. It says he has fallen asleep. Mm-hmm. Uh, asleep. Uh, well, the, 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 the problem is that nobody on the planet can wake him up. <laughs> he who had the power, that he showed you he had power, he raised the dead. Oh, yeah. He got the land who had to, to almost dissolve four days in hot sun. He was thinking, and all he said, all he said, he, 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 he said, Lazarus, come forth. Mm-hmm. Come forth. Yeah. Uh, come, come forth. Yeah. The one who can wake, you, wake us up, help us, Jesus. Oh, yeah. When he was on the planet, he could do, he could, he could, he could do it. But, but our awakening, there's a period of time that's going to take place. Mm-hmm. I, don't know, I don't know the day, nor the hour, but he does. And, yeah. and listen, listen, listen. We are laying down in those deposits all over the place with this body, the first Adam, but the second Adam is a spiritual body. Mm-hmm. Right? The, the trump of God shall sound. Oh, yeah. And we go, because it, 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 it's a trump that trump goes out is to bring the army to attention. That's what it does. And everybody, every every Christian in the grave, wherever they may be, is going to hear that sound. That body will hear that sound, and they're going to have to get up. Oh, yeah. Because yeah. we we who are alive is going to be caught up. And every man in his own his own order. Grandma going first, and somebody else going second, and then you get your chance. So no, no, no panic. You know, like you know, they get that cheese or something. They run, everybody run around. You, can't, you, you, ain't, you ain't gonna run out of this. Huh? You going? Mm-hmm. But you going in your own order. Right. Help us, Lord. Oh, yeah. yeah. I don't know what number it is, but I know I got a one. I know I'm in the. I, I'm in the number. In the number. Help us, <laughs> You know, we try to get there before they run out of stuff. And be running over folks, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Hope we get mine when they run out. Mm-hmm. And we ain't got to worry about this. He, he, he got enough grace. And he had enough grace to save all of us. Oh, yeah. He got enough yeah. grace. He said, he'll save my father's house. Mm-hmm. He said, oh, he said, oh, many, man. Many. Many, many. And if you were not so, I would have told you. There's plenty good room. Oh, yeah. Help us, Jesus. Help us, Jesus. But well, he has put all things under, under his feet. Verse 12. But when he said all things are put under his feet, it is written that he, that he is expected, which did put all things under him. And when all things shall be subdued under him, then shall the Son also himself be subject to him that put all things under him, that put that God may be all in all. The Son, mm-hmm. this is the God here. This thing is in the God here. Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, they're equal in divine perfection. Yeah. There's not one greater than the other. Mm-hmm. Help us, Lord. 
but this is how this is how they operate. And, and we know this because you revealed it to us. Yeah. Now we ain't stand on smart theologians and this kind of stuff. We can only say what he says about himself. Mm -hmm. That the son submitted himself to the father in a, in a role. He was in the role of redemption. He's the one that the father sends and then he comes. He comes. He comes in submission. Mm -hmm. Not that he didn't have power. What he does believe it was he was empty himself. Huh? Now he can't be he can't be he, he can't be anything other than God who's going to empty himself. But that, that means that he refused to, to use his divine prerogative. He got hungry, and yet he made all things. Mm -hmm. He walked on water, yet he was thirsty. Yeah. He was submissive to the Holy Spirit, and he was given the, the spirit without measure. But because of his submission, because of his humiliation, uh, it was his, it was it was by the, 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 the counsel of the Holy Spirit of the, of the Godhead that it would be that way in order to save man. Mm -hmm. Not to save angels, but to save man. Yeah. It was all, it was all, it was all really worked out before there was a when or where. The God had already Work worked out. it out and fixed it just when they did. They knew the conclusion. Mm -hmm. Oh, help us, Lord. <laughs> help us, Lord. They knew the conclusion, man. There was, there was nothing that there was not in the plan that, that, that could not take place. That, that, that they had everything planned out from the from the time he he he, he left heaven and came into the belly of this woman all the way to the time he ascended to heaven. All everything was done in order and in time, in God's time, because he's sovereign. Yeah. He's a sovereign God. Everybody so so the end, in the end, the, the son. The son gives everything back to the father. Remember the father who, who wrote it out in eternity yeah. gave it to the son. Mm -hmm. Is that the 14th chapter of, of John? He said, Father, all those things that you gave me, I lost none. Mm -hmm. They belong to the father. Mm -hmm. uh, they were his already that he gave to the son. And the son, the son of mission mm -hmm. was to die for those of whom the father gave him. And he said, I, I give them all. Mm -hmm. And not just those in the present time, but those in the future. Yes. He could not lose none that the Father, because the Father didn't just give him those apostles right here and there, but he gave him those beyond that. Those who would hear the gospel and believe, those who are part of the elect would hear and be saved. None can be lost. Mm -hmm. He said, got the terrible Negroes. <laughs> that belongs to each other. Well, he knew what's perfect. He's perfected us. Yes, he but he didn't, he didn't save us because we were doing good. Stop with me. Think about it. He didn't come to save good people. No. I know they didn't say, oh, I don't do this, I don't smoke, I don't chew, I don't kiss women who do with us. <laughs> yeah, but, but he didn't come to save good people. Mm -hmm. He come to save the wretched. In uh, matter of fact, everybody is, is rich. Everybody oh, yeah. is low down and yeah. terrible. Uh, and the only thing that differentiates folks is, is the restraining power of God. Uh, that some are not worse than others. Uh, mm -hmm. Because all men, all men are doing what? They're falling. Mm -hmm. All men are in the free fall. Uh, it's only God who holds up some. Yeah. And don't let men fall all the way to the ground. Uh, he's God. And, and then you're but there coming a time when the restraining power of the Holy Spirit is going to be taken away. Help them. And again, get that way almost now. Yes, folks are is. doing well, ex exactly what they want to do. Well, the world is in chaos. Men are doing some atrocious stuff mm -hmm. and thinking nothing of it. Cutting up people, killing babies, doing all kinds yeah, of stuff yeah. that the Bible says would happen because these are the last days. And because of the last days, sin is running, is running rapid. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And God's still in control. He's still in control. But he says to you as a Christian, don't panic. Because these things have to take place. You see, he says, he said, he said, rejoice for your redemption. It's not. Evil got to reach his climax. As good as reached his climax in Christ, evil got to reach his climax. And when it happens, when it happens, God's going to snatch the church out of here. Mm -hmm. uh, remember the last time he did something like that? He said, "Flood." He said, "The yes. great flood." 
Uh, take Amen. that great flood and kill everything on the planet except except the Lord and his and his uh, and his family. Yeah. Uh, well, he said he put the rainbow and the homosexuals got the rainbow. Uh, yeah. All things, <laughs> all kinds of symbols. Can they Out of all, yeah, they did. That's what it shows you. Out of all the all the symbols that they can they can stand under is the rainbow, a, a symbol of the judgment of God. He said, I promise you, it ain't gonna be water next time. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be fire. Mm -hmm. And they, they got their flags all out, parades it all down. And I said, they did this, they did the devil, they told you that. They just crazy they want to be. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. It's not that crazy. Absolutely. Uh -huh. Yes, they are. Let's see. In verse 29, I say, yes, what, what shall they do? Let me get to this one. And when, when the old thing shall be subdued unto him, then shall the son also himself be subject to him, and that all things under him, that God may be all in all. Amen. Else what shall they do which are baptized for the dead? The dead rise not at all. Why are they being baptized for the dead? They had to say about, about folks who died before they were baptized, and I think theologians yeah. say that this was some of the things that they would do. <clears throat> they had somebody be baptized for them. Somebody who had a was, yeah, had accepted the gospel, but died before they were baptized. Oh, they had accepted. They had accepted they had Christ, okay. but they hadn't been baptized yet. All right. Mm -hmm. It's somebody that they were. They no, were, okay. no, somebody that, that okay. believed the gospel, okay. and and but they had not been baptized yet. Uh, and so and so okay. and so so you had somebody in substitute. There's somebody in substitute. Mm -hmm. you know I'm, I'm being baptized so, so she had believed y'all, but he said she died and she couldn't be, you know, mm -hmm. and so they, 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 but they ain't baptism that saved us, right? No. Right. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That yeah. was a symbol of their belief. Yeah, it was a symbol of their belief. That's right. Same way it is. Right. But, but, but they, they, they had this, and the most of you that's the thing that, that, uh, that they did. They baptized for the dead. Right. Mm -hmm. uh, in substitute. They were, they would do it. People, they would do it for they, Died prior, so they wanted they had somebody to be baptized in their place. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, so that was the thing. So he said, "Why did they get, Why did they baptize if, if this if Christ, the dead did not rise? Why did they they did baptize for the dead? And why stand we rejected it every hour? I protest by you and rejoicing which I have in Christ Jesus, our Lord, our Lord. I die daily. Mm -hmm. If after the manner of men I have fought while with beasts at Ephesus." What advantage it me if the dead rise not? Let us eat and drink for all we got. Yeah. So if he didn't rise, we, we just, like I said, we just want to throw a party. Mm -hmm. Now, these people that you talk about is men. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah, yeah. a metaphor. Yeah. That's, that's just a metaphor. Right. You're like, you know, Paul, Paul's under 100, close to 100 pounds. He ain't able to fight nothing. They pity him. They're they talking to those beasts. Yeah, and, and people act like that, that the nature of the yeah, man. The nature of the yeah, man. yeah, yeah. People act like worship beasts. Yeah. They, act, they can be worse, and sometimes worse than beasts in the church. Yeah. They, mm -hmm. they, they, they have no mercy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they'll tear you up. Mm -hmm. Help us, Lord. They'll, they'll tear you up. They say, they say, if after the man of men I have fought with, with beasts at Ephesus, what advantage if, if, if the dead rise now? Let us eat and drink for Lord of God. Be not deceived. Evil communication corrupts good manners. Yeah, evil communication corrupts good manners. It says, Away to righteousness and sin not, for some of them are not the knowledge of God. I speak to this to your, to your shame. Yeah. But some men will say, How are the dead? Now, this is another thing. They say, The dead rise. Well, how did they raise? You? Actually, this is how to raise the question. Yeah. I, Paul gives them an example. You know, right. what body are they raised? Now, what kind of bodies did it mean? All kind of bodies, right? He said, "Thou fool, that which thou sowest is not quickened except to die, and that you some got to die unless it would become alive, right? Every seed has to die. You say, except I die, you know, if I die, then you can, you know, multiply the seed. The seed will, will, will live." He said, "But thou," he said, "and that which thou sowest, thou sowest not that body that shall be, but has grain." It may chant a week or of exactly. some other to come up something different. Mm -hmm. Whatever you put down, it comes up, it dies, and come up something different. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, but but God gave, gave it a body 
and it has pleased him and to every seed his own body. Okay. All flesh is not the same flesh. And we read that most at funerals, there, but there is one kind of flesh of men, another flesh of beasts, another of fishes, and another of birds. There are also celestial bodies and bodies terrestrial, but the glory of the celestial is one, and the glory of the terrestrial is another. There is one glory of the sun, and another glory of the moon, and another glory of the stars. For one star differs from another star in glory. So also the resurrection of the dead. It is sown in corruption, it is raised in incorruption. It is sown in dishonor, it is raised in glory. It is sown in weakness, it is raised in power. It is sown a natural body, it is raised a spiritual body. There's a natural body, and there's a spiritual body. And so it is written, the first man Adam was made a living soul, and the last Adam was made a quickening spirit. How be it that, that, that was first which is spiritual, but that which is natural, which is natural, and afterwards that which is spiritual. The first man is of the earth earthly, the second man is the law of heaven. And as the earth is such that they also that are earthly, and as the heavenly, such as they also which are heavenly. And as we have borne the image of the earthly, we shall also bear the image <coughs> of the heaven. We pause right there. Right. Yeah, so we got this Adam body. This, the, the, this is the Adamic body that we have. Full of sin and everything, death. But the, but the, the other body is a, is, a, is, a, is a spiritual body, the Christ. Right? It's from the second Adam. Uh, that's, how, that's what we're looking forward to. And he shows us what that body is capable of when he got up from the dead, walked through walls and stuff, and had power to move from one place to the other. He, had a, he was a spiritual body. And listen, he said, he said, he, he, he was not just a spirit. He said, he said, the, he gave me some what y'all got to eat. Mm -hmm. uh, and he, he ate that yeah. food. Yeah. And he said, and he said, he really, they told me he was a he was a spirit. He said, he said, he said the time was touch me. Mm -hmm. uh, put your hand in my side. Mm -hmm. Touch my hands. Mm -hmm. you know? So we're gonna have a unique body. Mm -hmm. This body is subject to decay and sickness and what have you. And it ages and it's falling apart day by day. But when we die, we will die. And the inward man is renewed. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, and that's that's where we are. That's where we'll be. And so all y'all worry about your hair and your teeth and, and, mm -hmm. and all this kind of care and all. And the more you try to fix it, the, you fix it on one end and stuff goes wrong on the other end. Uh -huh. your, your knees begin oh, to yeah. start cracking and stuff. And, and you feel you, you, you feel you can't you can't move like you used to move. And then the music come on. And then you, you start trying to get things going. <laughs> and afterwards, you're sorry. You're so sorry. Uh huh. Stuff was wrong. You let your, you let your back fall slip. And all that kind of you can't do that no more. Oh, you can't do that because it slipped. Yeah. <laughs> this, 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 is, this body belongs to the Lord. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Right. Thank you, Lord. He said, so if it belongs to him, he said, I'll be putting all those tattoos on it. That's, That's it. it. That's right. That's right. Putting that earrings and stuff all in your face and oh, your nose and all that oh, because it's not your body. Oh, yeah. It belongs to him. Don't do what the heathens does, he said. Yeah, and I'm, I'm setting it out for Christians. Yeah, you meet Christians, they got stuff coming all out of their nose and stuff and, and you know, all kind of stuff coming all out of your ears and stuff. <laughs> and stuff piercing the eyes and stuff like that. He said, don't do any tattoos because every kind of tattoo you want a name on there. Yeah. Oh my God, what kind of stuff we got? All in the body, all the everywhere you can name. Every, yeah, on the Lord, all the Lord's property. You were bought with a price you are not you're not your own. Huh? He can't tell you for the rest of us. Help us, Jesus. So so this is this is this is our lesson for tonight. This is Pastor C. L. Franklin from Rogers Club Mission of Baptist Church. Come join us on the Wednesday night, seven o'clock in church service again at eleven on the Sunday. Come and holler and scream and from nine, um, Sunday schools at 9.30 and come and see if we do teaching and do the day and do that Bible church Sunday school. So come and be part of and part of this, this, this ministry and to learn my people perish for, for the lack of knowledge. Come and hear the word of God as we be preaching as we talk. Thank you tonight. Hope to see you. Dale, get me off of the day. Amen. Great teacher. Yes, it was.